What is up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Part97 and welcome you back to another Survivor Island video. Thank you all for the support you have been giving me on the last two videos that I have made on Survivor Island and it has been, meant a lot to me. Today, it's going to be like another wiki. we got a couple of things I'm going to show you how to make today to make yourself look gorgeous like myself. Um, that will be the hat, the poncho, or the cape, whatever you want to call it pants let's actually show you how to make this clothes it's very easy straightforward but i'm also going to be showing you the most important item which is the backpack so let's do that guys it's going to be a little bit of a longer tutorial but you can skip through it i'll leave some annotations anyway in the comments down below um again i'll leave the link on the discord as well if you want to have a chat with myself or any of the devs as well um very um cool to be chatting with them all anyway all right so in this episode here yes we're gonna be showing how to make the skirts the, uh, the cape and that but we also be showing you how to make a circular frame and also braided fibers so let's start off with the most important one the skirt we always know the skirt is the most important piece of uh yeah of uh, clothing anyway so we'll do that so tie each part of uh, a palm leaf and this here will make you a skirt very easy very quick i won't put it on or anything like that um why didn't i do it did it on that one there yeah, that's weird there we go try it again there it is skirt all right, that was very easy. All right, so we've got our rope. We'll just chuck it back in our backpack for the moment. The last one is the cape. Now, the cape is probably a lot easier. You don't need to use root rope or anything like that. You can just plate the actual fibers off the palm, um, and from there, it will make your cape. Very quick, very simple. There it is, your cape. So that is your skirt. Just see if I can kind of... See if I can do it. No, not quite. Oh, anyway. From there, we will then chuck one of these palm leaves on top of each other. We'll grab our handy dandy rope and then we'll just go and attach that. This will make a rain hat. Very important to keep that water off. Very quick tutorial there. If you want to slow it down, please do. Um, this shows how to make it very quickly. There's not mu too much there. Um, in my previous videos, I have shown you how to make fiber as well. Let's get into the more advanced ones. So from there, we're going to have to make these smaller sticks. Now, I actually... Whoops. Uh, I actually gathered two sticks for the um, show and tell of this one here. I hope my blade survives up for it. Um, I'm a bit thirsty, but that's okay. I'll cover that a bit later. Um, I'll just quickly get into this and finish this off. So I've got two sticks over here. Now, if you were to cut the end, the thick end, this is what actually happens. It splits the end. So what you want to do is you want to cut at the short end where it's not as fat. So I've got myself back a knife. Of course I had to break on me. It only took one of them and then it breaks on me again. So yeah, you cut all three ends because what happens if you cut that thick end, it will basically, what else I keep doing that? It will split the wood at the top and then you can't actually make your thin sticks. So now that we've done that, we have now made some thin sticks. All right, so we've got some thin sticks. This will be really, uh, this is really handy for when we are making the bag. And we're going to take two of these sticks over to our workbench. If I don't pick up another coconut uh, top, I'm a bit of a messy person at the moment on this island. Go over to here. We'll place it uh, right here and here. Um, from there, we'll just go and grab our handy dandy rope and we will just tie these two together. This should make that uh, spinny little triangle. Now, from there, you will need to grab one of these. Now, to make that is a great question. To go over to one of these items, you go to plate. Um, and what this does here is it will transform it into that uh, braided fiber. Um, from there, we just keep crafting a few of these because we're going to need a few of them to make the actual bag. Um, but first things first, we've got to make a base. I'm hoping I have enough rope to do this. I'm pretty sure I do. I've got two ropes in my um, backpack. It should be enough. Um, but we'll see how it goes. From there, we're almost done. There we go. So let's grab one of these that we've got here. I have one actually set up over here. We'll leave this on there for now. We'll then place one of these on here and then we'll grab our rope. From there, we'll just tie this onto the actual base and voila, we've got a circular um, thing. So from there, let's chuck this back into our 
backpack and then we'll just grab some sticks if it doesn't there we go did pick up get our craft for a second and then let's go back into it so from there we've got four corners we need one two go and grab two more sticks give me a second three four again keeping our rope on handy because we're going to need the rope in a second again we're going to tie all four corners so i should actually have enough in the, this rope which is quite surprising uh so let's do that and that then we'll do that and one more for good measure we'll do that side there as well there we go handy as that we got one rope left so we're, i'm hoping i got enough here so i have made more than enough over here as we can see we've got four this will make the sides of our ba uh, basket look quite nice it's a long process to actually making it but it's really rewarding once you have actually done it um, and it makes things so much easier going to gather fibers and all that just makes things so easy all right so from there we go back and grab our rope and we go back and tie again just because we can the next part is going to be the hardest and i just realized i am missing rope you will need an extra two ropes so all up to make a basket i believe you need four or f nope you need five all up because um yeah the rope i've got is not enough to make the next stage you actually need more so there is three more spots as you can tell and we've got the top so if we go and grab one of these uh, which we'll do you can place this on top but we're missing two bits of rope because we can tie this that's no problem but we need two more bits of rope to actually finish the final stages of the basket so what i'm going to do is i'm going to quickly grab some more fibers and I'll be right back with you all right so i went back out there and i grabbed some more fiber um that wasn't too bad it was just a bit of a gather we will need to make three ropes so basically to give you guys a bit of an idea two of them will be your straps um, and the other one we're just going to use to actually tie so what i'll just show you from here is is if you press q it places it on the back going to be very needed um, otherwise you can't sling it over your shoulder but it just shows you guys how complex the design is of the game um, and i love that fact about it it just makes you think it makes you think Oh, how can you do it without tutorials or anything like that it's it's not an easy um, stretch from there you just tie these three spots so one two we've retied really the top because our rope snapped on that last one and ta-da that is how you make a gorgeous bag absolutely love doing this guys for you guys again another tutorial if you guys want to see something whether you want to see me do buildings tips anything like that you let me know i have some tools as well i can show you how to make i can show you guys how to make a spear i can show you guys how to make the greater hammer the greater axe and a few other bits and pieces i'm also at the moment still working on the bow and arrow but we'll get to that at a later date um for now guys thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did leave a like leave a comment and hit that subscribe button. I'll be back with you guys with some more videos later down the track. See you guys later.